Who is Margie Willett? Margie Willett is popularly known as the ex-wife of legendary American actor Dick Van Dyke. Dick Van Dyke got recognition through the CBS sitcom The Dick Van Dyke Show 1961 to 1966. Margie Willett and Dick Van Dyke tied the knot on the 12th of February 1948 in Chapman Park Hotel, Los Angeles. The couple has four children together. However, the couple separated after spending more than three decades together in 1984. Margie Willett died of pancreatic cancer in 2008 after battling with it for one year. Please subscribe to our channel and support us. Marjorie Willett Childhood and Family Margie Willett was born in 1927, Illinois, United States. Margie Willett spent her teenage years with her parents in the United States. Margie Willett holds an American nationality and belongs to the white ethnicity. The information about her parents, siblings, and education is not yet out in the media. Margie Willett had no connection with Hollywood until she met her ex-husband Dick Van Dyke. Dick became one of Hollywood's biggest names after several years of marriage. Margie Willett was age 81 when she died of pancreatic cancer in 2008. Margie Willett Personality Traits Margie Willett was a very private person. She was quite a simple woman who lived a sheltered life with her husband and children. Hence, Margie had completely shielded herself from the paparazzi. Margie Willett was a perfect homemaker. Her life always revolved around her children and husband. Margie loved to keep her life simple and classy. She had dark brown short hair. According to her pictures on the web, Margie had an average height and weight. But, due to her private life, the information is not yet revealed. Margie and Dick Van Dyke Margie Willett and Dick Van Dyke met somewhere around 1940 in Illinois, United States. Margie and Dick loved each other very much. Margie and Dick Van Dyke decided to get engaged just after one month of their relationship. On the 12th of February 1948, the couple tied the knot in Chapman Park Hotel on Wilshire Boulevard in Los Angeles. It wasn't easy for the couple to sustain their life. Margie and Dick had a lot of financial difficulties during that period. Before making it to the Hollywood industry, Margie and Dick didn't have money to buy their own house. They spent their nights inside a car for many days. Sadly, the lovebirds didn't have money to fund their marriage, Dick Van Dyke was still struggling. A generous producer funded Margie and Dick's wedding. And, their wedding aired on a radio program named Bride and Groom. Also, the same person sponsored their honeymoon. Margie and Dick had to face a tragic stage in their life when they lost their twin babies in a miscarriage. Nevertheless, the couple gave birth to four children. They are Barry, Carrie, Stacy, and Christian. They have five grandchildren called Shane, Carrie, Tarin, Wes, and Jessica Van Dyke. Alongside, they have five great-grandchildren. The couple had a big family, indeed. One of his sons, Barry Van Dyke, also played Dick's on-screen son in Diagnosis Murder. Additionally, Dick Van Dyke's grandson Shane Van Dyke also appeared in the same show. Margie Willett and Dick Van Dyke spent a very blissful life together. But, their relationship collapsed after Dick had an extramarital affair with Michelle Triola. Unfortunately, the couple ended their 36 years of marriage in 1984. Margie's ex-husband Dick Van Dyke's career The legendary actor Dick Van Dyke was born in West Plains, Missouri, on 13 December 1925. He is the elder brother of Jerry Van Dyke, best known for the TV series Coach. The Dick Van Dyke Show, Bye Bye Birdie, Mary Poppins, 1964, and Chitty Chitty Bang Bang in 1968 were some of his notable works. Dick appeared in movies like the comic, Dick Tracy, Curious George, Night at the Museum, and Mary Poppins Returns, 2018. The actor also got huge recognition from his role in The New Dick Van Dyke Show, Diagnosis, Murder, 
and Murder 101. Dick Van Dyke has a considerable fan base in the USA and other countries of the world. Margie's son Barry Van Dyke. Barry was born on the 31st of July 1951 in Atlanta, Georgia. Barry, born the 31st of July 1951, is the second son of Margie Willett and Dick Van Dyke. Barry Van Dyke appeared in the series The New Dick Van Dyke Show, The Van Dyke Show, and Diagnosis, Murder with His Father. Barry Van Dyke also appeared in movies like Heavenly Deposit and The Untold Story in 2019. In 1974, Margie's son Barry married Mary Carey. Barry and Mary have four children together. Margie Willett Divorce Margie Willett and Dick Van Dyke were madly in love with each other for more than three decades. However, things started getting rough between them after Dick confessed his infidelity. Dick Van Dyke started having feelings for Michelle Triola, a secretary of Dick's agent. Dick and Michelle had a secret affair until 1976. Then Dick finally confessed to his wife, Margie Will, about his experience. Dick Van Dyke also revealed about his affair in his memoir, saying, I met a former actress, Michelle Triola, she was feisty, smart, and unlike Margie, knew the showbiz world inside out. He added, I was involved with a woman other than my wife. It was unbelievable. I was writhing in guilt. By 1976 I had to do something. I needed to be honest. Margie and Dick decided to live their life separately, they divorced in 1984. Willett's life after divorce. Margie Willett started living her life on her terms with her children. There was no rumor about her relationship status after her divorce. On the other hand, Dick lived 30 years of his life with Michelle Triola until she died in 2009. The actress had lung cancer. Three years after Michelle's death, 94-year-old Dick married makeup artist Arlene Silver. The night at the museum actors Dick Van Dyke and Arlene Silver have a massive age difference of 46 years. The couple is living a joyful and lavish life. Margie Willett Road to Fame Margie Willett had grabbed all the media attention after getting married to Dick Van Dyke. But, Margie isolated herself from the glitz and glamour industry. She lived a private life and never loved to interact with media houses. Margie Willett Drug Addiction In the late 40s, Margie Willett and Dick Van Dyke had a tough time living their life. The couple had no house to live in and could not live a peaceful life. At that time, Margie got into prescription drug addiction. And, Dick got addicted to alcohol. The actor Dick Van Dyke also admitted to his addiction to alcohol in his memoir. He stated, I progressed from being just a party drinker, to where I'd run a race with Margie each night to see if I could get drunk before she could get dinner on the table. The couple got admitted to the same rehabilitation center for their treatment. Margie Willett Death Margie Willett lived a low-key life away from media interference. Despite getting huge limelight as a celebrity wife, she lived an everyday life away from the media. Margie lived a peaceful life until she got diagnosed with pancreatic cancer in 2007. After battling cancer for a year, Margie died in 2008 at the age of 81 years. Margie Willett might have left us, but her remembrance is still there in her loved ones. Margie Willett Net Worth Margie Willett was living a lavish life with her husband and children. The exact data about her net worth is not yet out. But her former husband, Dick Van Dyke's estimated net worth is $30 million. Margie Willett Social Media Margie never got into social media platforms. She believed in living a private life away from cameras. Yet, you can follow Margie's former husband, Dick Van Dyke to know about his life. Instagram. You can follow him on Instagram as at official underscore Dick underscore Van underscore Dyke. Twitter. Dick Van Dyke is active on Twitter as at I am a Van Dyke. For more update visit celebcritics.com.